what's up everybody, just chilling in a bus hut, waiting for the bus to go to work. My reality life, I live two lives, entertainment life and then reality. So two lives, entertainer and then reality at its best. I take a bus, I'm not ashamed of it. Uh, but anyways, I feel like I annoy the hell out of people because I'm always pushing and promoting shows, talking about who's coming on, who I had on last year, the year before. I just, I'm, I'm excited man, I'm proud, because I, I, I sit back there and I think, man. I never thought I'd interview celebrities. So, you know, celebrities are regular people. I treat them like regular people. Obviously, I, I treat them, I treat them more as a family than I do a fan because everybody's asking, how come, how do you get these interviews? How come they're so laid back with you and chill? Because I treat them like family instead of a fan. But I, I like doing these interviews because it's a chase. Not that, but I've interviewed some people that I've, that I've watched on TV, watched on TV, listened to as a kid. Jack Russell's Great White was one of my dream interviews from the rock and roll ages. Got to interview them. Eric Martin and Mr. Big and uh, PJ Farley of Trickster. Got to interview them, both of them. I was, I was planning on interviewing Eric Martin just by himself, but PJ Farley was like, you know, I want to be in an interview too. So I got to interview him. Uh, Jake Roberts, Eric Bischoff, tons of uh, Kid Forhey, Kenan and Kel, Danny Trejo. Um, Leah Ford, you know, these are interviews that I wanted to, you know, interview people for my dream interviews. And, uh, you know, I'm just sitting back and I'm thinking in my head, I'm wondering if these people are getting annoyed, like the Freddie Grody type of annoyance. I just like to push and promote things out there. I do a TV show, I push and promote things. Uh, and I see, like, people post videos like today, one of my friends posted, uh, To Be With You by Mr. Big. And I was like, hey, I got to interview them. Or somebody posted something on Nappy Roots when Chris Easley got to interview them. Or, you know, I just, it's, I'm just proud of being a guy from, uh, being a guy that's pretty much basically poor and, and everything. And I'm, I, and I'm living my dream. I've been doing TV since I was 14. And again, like I said, I give opportunities to anybody local, national talent. So I'm not just all about celebrities because. This season, I'm mainly staying like local and showing some old school stuff. So, again, like I said, my shows aren't all about celebrities. I just like feel like I'm annoying people because people don't hardly respond to some of my stuff that I do. So I just feel like I'm annoying people. I'm not trying to annoy people. I'm just letting people know, hey, I'm still here. I might have took a month off to take time on my vacation. My, you know, take time with my boys because they're, they're my world. My, my family's my world. So. I'm not trying to annoy people, it's just, I feel like I'm annoying people, that's why I put today on Facebook, I feel like I'm annoying people. You gotta stay fresh and new, because people do forget about you. That's the thing about the fan game, or anything in life, people forget about you. So you gotta be in their face to remind them that you're still here. That's the way to do it.